Hi. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, more exciting news in CES 2022, health tech company. Moveano is announcing the Moveano Ring, a wearable that aims to help people affordably monitor chronic illnesses and better understand their data. The Moveano Ring has some lofty medical ambitions, but it'll need FDA clearance first. The Moveano Ring will measure all the basic metrics, including heart rate, heart rate variability, HRV, sleep, respiration, temperature, blood oxygen levels, steps, and calories burned. However, Instead of a raw data dump, Muvano says it'll distill how your metrics relate to each other take a more proactive approach to mitigating the risks of chronic disease. For example, the Muvano app might tell you how your exercise habits impact your sleeping patterns or HRV over time. The Muvano ring won't be available until the second half of 2022, and even then, it'll be a beta version. News source, The Verge, says 2022. Talking about wearables for women's health, Aletone, the first non-surgical, non-invasive treatment for pelvic floor disorders, to the world at CES 2022. The easy, effective, and external femtech for pelvic floor disorders, is a finalist for the Global Women's Health Tech Awards, a World Bank Group and Consumer Technology Association initiative to recognize innovations that leverage tech to improve women's health and safety in emerging markets. Elitone has been tested in clinical studies reviewed by the FDA. In one study 95% of women reported fewer urine leaks, with an average reduction of 71% in only 6 weeks. Pad use decreased by 85%. FDA cleared and C marked, Elitone provides discretion and privacy. No one needs to know a woman is doing her pelvic floor exercises as the Elitone clips discreetly at one's waistline under clothes. Elida the maker of Elitone, holds several patents on this revolutionary device and maintains ISO 13485-2016 certification as a medical device manufacturer. Elida is a women-owned medical device company based in Connecticut, USA, largely funded by the National Science Foundation. News source, Women of Wearables, Metaverse Group announced new partners, including Decentraland, Renovi, and GDA Capital. The token subsidiary plans to launch a startup competition that encourages founders, students architects, and 3D designers from all over the world to participate and develop digital infrastructure. The Build-A-Thon competition encourages participants to create digital architecture, which includes buildings, museums, NFT galleries, casinos, and more. Winners of the competition will receive $250,000 granted by the Dectraland Foundation, $50,000 of Renovite tokens, and software programs. Applications are open from January 30th until March 31st, 2022. Startups will pitch to a panel of industry experts from the crypto and architectural industries. More details are available on the website. News source, Financial Post, for creators, the question now becomes not if they will shift to the metaverse, but when will they do so. Metafluence is an early pioneer looking to bridge the current gap between influencer marketing and the metaverse. Metafluence enables influencers to monetize their social media power and creativity in the metaverse. Metafluence will come to represent the name of a single city in the metaverse, one that social media influencers will control. The city itself will comprise influencer homes, also known as meta huts, aka storefronts for products which can be customized based on the influencer's choice. Custom spaces will provide an added opportunity for influencers to better monetize their audience and continue engaging closer with brands. News source, Cointelegraph, Samsung Electronics America is launching a virtual store called the Samsung 837X in Decentraland. The temporary virtual store will mirror Samsung's physical store at 837 Washington Street in New York City's Meatpacking District. The store will only be open for a limited time in Decentraland and marks the biggest brand takeover in Decentraland history. Guests can enter the Decentraland store via web browser, and after logging in, 
they will be greeted by a virtual guide and can browse and buy NFTs in the metaverse. The project is launched to demonstrate the endless possibilities of blockchain technology and its cultural significance. News source, VentureBeat, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.